Hi, I'm Anthony Santora here from Santora Zone, and I, I flew all the way into Kansas City today so I can work out with Brooke here. And Brooke has his own uh, personal fitness uh, business, and I'm going to turn it over to him and let him tell you a little bit about what he does and how he's going to help me today. My business, my brand, be the right fit by BLP. I'm certified through National American Sports Medicine, and my goal, my aim, is to show you, the people, the safest, most effective exercises without getting injured. My, best, my, my good buddy Anthony here is gonna kind of help us with that. Okay, I've got, a, I've got a, like a minor shoulder injury from, uh, from just exercising, and uh, it, it seems like uh, it's just not going away. So today, um, we're gonna do some stuff. I'm gonna do whatever Brooke wants me to do, and the, the, the message here is, you know, personal health, um, physical health, and that's kind of what we're demonstrating right now. So, Brooke, you tell me what it is you want me to do, and I'll just do it. So, we are going to be working on shoulders, and what I really want to emphasize for everyone out there is that even though he has a shoulder injury, his is up front, right? I can't diagnose that. I'm not a doctor. I had a shoulder injury on top, but I learned to compensate by instead of lifting those 100 pound dumbbells above my head by using light weight, okay? So number one, what we're gonna first start off with, we're gonna grab a five pound dumbbell. Okay. And I'll do it with you, Anthony. Okay. All right, so holding your right hand, we're gonna lock. All right. Lock our elbow to our sides. I'm ready. So now we're going to internally rotate all the way so, in. So, over here. All the way in, now all the way out, as far as you can. Lock that, shoulder, that elbow into the side. That's one. We're gonna do it 10 times. Two, three, keep going. Four, five, beautiful. Six, lock it in. Seven, seven. Okay, lock it, it's in. hard, I know. Eight, nine, 10. ten. That's okay. why it helps having a piece of paper or well, I'll even use my cell phone. If I drop this, I have to spend $200 to get a new one. I can't afford that. I don't even have $200 to my name. All right? So, okay. I'm a risk taker. I'm gonna lock my elbow. I'm you gotta do your left one Left now. one, okay, we gotta switch. Okay, so I'm here. Balanced. So now, all the way in. All the way in. All the way out, that's one, two, three, four, Five, good job. Six, seven, eight. I'm like, hopefully it doesn't fall. <laughs> Nine, ten. Okay. That was beautiful. Yeah. Now the common mistake that I see everyone make. You can go ahead and put these down. Okay. Before people do it, their elbows are all the way out here. And as a manager, as a personal trainer, I can't come up to you in the gym and say, "Hey man, you're doing that wrong." I come off. I, I won't use any vulgar language, but it would just be rude that there's a certain gym etiquette you can't do as a personal trainer and a manager at a gym, okay? But just take from this, those small rotator cuff muscles need to be worked. They're, it's very hard to get blood flow into there. So if you don't have it attached to your side, you're just working your deltoids, your anterior deltoid, medial, and your posterior, all three muscles of your shoulder, okay? Now, next what we're gonna be doing, Anthony, is we're gonna be going up just five more pounds. This is all we need, folks. All right, we don't need much. So, I have a bench right here. Okay. It's gonna give you 10 pounds. Okay, I got 10 pounds. I know, it's heavy, <laughs> right? right? Okay. So first what we're gonna do, shoulders back. Shoulders back. Hold them together at an angle. Like that. Like that, okay. But hold them, hold them together. Like this. At an angle. There you go. Okay. Look at that angle, isn't that beautiful? Now come up, 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 up. You should feel it right there. Stop. Yeah. Slowly come down, slow. Now come up, at least three seconds up, at least three seconds down. We're gonna do 10, two, there you go. I feel that working. Three, that's beautiful. Awesome. See, you're, he's controlling the weight, and I'm losing count because I'm talking. But that's okay. <laughs> you have to keep count of your reps. 
All right? You're doing good. I don't even know what number you're on, but it doesn't even matter, doesn't it, Anthony? It doesn't matter. Because you're working. He's working his anterior deltoid, the front of your shoulder. It doesn't matter until it starts burning. <laughs> that's when it counts. Okay. Yeah, that's when oh, I start is that, taking. Is that 10? Oh, no. This will probably be more. 10 right here. Okay, that's okay. He's good. He's good. All right. Now, for, since, since Anthony has a shoulder injury, um, like I've said before, we'll get into a lot of more drop sets, supersets, stuff that's foreign to you right now. But you'll speak the language uh, here soon. <laughs> uh, but we'll give him a minute, a minute okay. pass, and then we'll, we'll jump into some medial, medial delts, some side lateral raises. Okay. Okay. Can I tell him how I'm feeling right now in, in my little bit of break? Yeah, you. Okay. Go so, ahead. Sorry. so one of the one of the things on, on the first exercise, I noticed, it, it, as minor as it might be, I'm I'm doing the exercise like this, and I and I hear his voice, and I see the sound guy telling me to tuck my elbow in. Now, once I tucked my elbow in, I felt the full exercise pretty much taken over right here. I felt it working everything. So just that little minor push right there and going back, it, it really made a, a huge difference. I didn't really, it was kind of easy until I did that. So that technique, it allowed me to kind of mentally focus my mind yeah. to my muscle because it was hurting. So instead of, instead of just like this, I'm like, okay, I can feel that. So now I'm, I'm talking to it. I'm like, okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. You know, so I just wanted to point that out as how I felt when I was doing it. Doesn't it feel great though? It does. But you have no idea. Me working in a gym and being around a gym for six, six plus years. You know, when I, when I first started, I didn't know what the heck I was doing. I was just going to grab a tape towards machinery. But once you finally learn these things, you just want to tell so many people because you're like, oh my yeah. God, you're going to go through the same injury that I did. And I don't want that for you. I don't want that for you. It's huge. I mean, it's, it's literally altered the way I live, you know, because everything I do that I would normally do, you know, subconsciously, I, I get reminded that I've got some pain here and I have to switch arms. And the more I do that, the less strength I get in this arm because I'm using it less for normal situations. So, oh know. my goodness. You yeah. Know what? Do you know what time it is? It's medial delt demolition time. Let's do this. Let's do it. All right. I tens. love it. Okay. All right. I got my tens. Now, the beauty of this one again, we're just using 10 pound weights, folks. Nothing heavy. Yeah. All right. So, okay. I want, I want to show from a lateral point of view. All right. All right. We're going to lean forward. Okay. Keep the back straight. Back straight. Shoulders back. Back. Bend down, bend down, bend down, bend down, bend down. Bring these up forward. Okay. Like this. Okay. Thumbs pointing out. Okay. Imagine a line straight up here. Straight in line with your with your ear. Bring it up to the side. Right there. One. Beautiful. Two. Three. And I feel that. Four. That's awesome. Keep going. Keep going. Five. He's controlling the light weight. Don't don't be one of those people who tries to do forties and look cool. You're not gonna look cool when you tear something and have to end up in the in the hospital with thousands of dollars in medical bills. <laughs> Once again, I lost count. I'm sorry. <laughs> There you go. Good job. Good job, Anthony. Ten pounds. Ten pounds. Okay, it felt like I was lifting my own body weight. I mean, it. The good, the, the great thing about these videos is you have you have Brooke here to not only talk to you about the importance of, you know, the amount of weight that you're using, but the technique is so, so important. Just by taking minor changes and getting the right technique, you can make that 10 and five pound weight really do, you know, a lot for you. And I'm, I'm out of breath. And all I did was these fives and these tens what, what appears to be a very simple workout. Now, if I would have done it on my own, 
I probably wouldn't have got the same workout because I, I wouldn't have done that. I wouldn't have had you know good form. I would have just done what was easy. I probably would have swung the weight up and done it real fast. And over here, I'm sure I would have you know done like this, not gone all the way up. But just by applying the form and the technique, I got a times 10 workout uh, with just some really small weights. And that's how I feel right now, that my upper shoulders are, are burning a little bit. And we did 10, 10, and 10, that was it. That's it. That was it's it. so simple. And it's so simple. Yeah, and if you, if you watch the video and you have, um, and you, if you eliminated all the, the talking and just focused on the workout, I mean, literally five minutes, of workout and I feel it you know that's how I feel right now it's it's tight you know if we did it again and then maybe one more rep I'd, I'd be done my shoulders would be toast but yeah, they might be toast after the second one <laughs> but that's okay is one, one thing I tell everyone I don't care when people come to me as a as a client like as a first session or if I give them an orientation it's like they're embarrassed that they can't do a push-up it's like, I remember when I couldn't even do five push, you know, you know, you know what I mean? I couldn't do a pull up. You have to start from ground zero and work your way up. And in time, that's why fitness is a lifestyle change. It takes time. And I've also talked with a lot of people who when they, they feel like they hit their plateaus, that's when it's most crucial, especially with weight loss, people, which it's, it's a beautiful thing because I've actually gotten to see a lot of people lose weight and we'll, we'll put in some testimonials later. Sure, and, and absolutely. Have, to, have them talk. Yeah. Um, but you just have to put the time in. It's a lifestyle change. There, there's no, I want to lose 30 pounds and then I just want to go back to Thanksgiving. No, uh-uh. It doesn't work like that. And this is a year-round thing. We're constantly trying to better our bodies, better our mind, our body, our soul. We're just trying to work towards progressing. And, okay. and the, the, the workout that we, we just did, uh, just want to emphasize on it, we're talking about two five-pound weights that you can do in your living room. And these are very inexpensive. These ones might be a little bit more, but you can get these, you know, and you can do just a few little things we did right from home just watching what we're doing and get the same exact, you know, uh, same exact workout. You don't have to feel like you can't, you have to be in this, this setting. It's nice to be in this setting, you know, because you see all the people working out, but sometimes it can be a little intimidating, as you said, when you're not really familiar with the gym exactly. and you come in and you see all these guys that have been here and, you know, you try to either mimic them or you, you know, get, you know, uh, mentally defeated and you just don't do anything. You know, so that was a very simple but effective workout with many more to come. With so I'm excited, I'm but super excited. Before, before anything else, what you'll find with my workouts, no muscle, no stone, goes unturned. So what have we not made yet? Our posterior. You know this, come on. Okay, right. so we're gonna do another workout. I'm ready. <laughs> One more, that's okay. it, that's okay. it. Uh, We're gonna do it on this bench though. Okay. Okay, so come on nice down. down. I'm ready. All right, put your feet, like, probably right right here. Okay, together or just spaced? Uh, just far out so you can hold these 10 pound dumbbells. Now lean forward on your knees. Together. Okay. A little bit closer to me. All right, now lean forward all the way, all the way. All the way down. Let, let the weight drop under behind your heels. And you're gonna bring it back like this. Okay. Bring it towards your head level. Because when you laterally raise it up, right, the higher you raise it up, the more you're going to engage your posterior, the back of your shoulder. Okay? Okay. So now so laterally raise up. it up like that. There's one. Two. Three. Good job. Four, perfect. Five, control. Six, wonderful, Anthony. Seven, eight, two more, my man. Nine, ten. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> Drop it like it's hot, baby, let me tell you. I just got a full workout in 10 minutes. This Bye. whole area. 
Like exactly. literally 10 minutes. I mean, 10, 10, 10, 10. We did, we did 40 total, right, of 10 of each little section of your arm. So, so the rotator cuff, I always do that before to blood flow in there and afterwards. It's kind of a cool down just to get blood flow in there with the five pounds, with the five pounds though. So we'll do 10 more, 10 more of each of those. Okay. The, so the right arm, lock, okay. it, lock it in place. Yeah, I'm gonna try it, now this time I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna mentally know that I need to be here and I need to keep it there. So I'm just gonna turn there it. You go. There we go. One, two, three. Shoulders keep my shoulder level, okay. Yeah. And as I squeeze, squeeze, I'm trying to focus on that particular muscle mentally because I feel it burning and if I'm, if I'm mentally talking to it, I know it's happening. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't even have count, but I know it's burning. <laughs> That's okay. good. That's okay. good. Can we do switch? Switch it up, my man. Okay. Switch it up. This is so awesome right now, you don't even know. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Okay. Okay, now I'm talking to my muscle now. I can feel it. Okay, now it's talking back to me. <laughs> Good job. Good job. And I haven't even counting. I'm just, I'm just doing it till I start feeling it all burn. All the way in, all the way in. All the way in, technique, go in, here we go. I can feel it. Let's just do three more. Uh, stay tight. Three. Let me get that for you. You deserve it. Thank you, Anthony. All right. Thank you. That was awesome. Okay, thank you, Rookie. It's, <laughs> it's awesome. So I, 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 I do, um, I gotta say it though, I mean, I, I do these exercises at uh, where, where I'm from, where, where I'm at now, and for 30, 45 minutes, I go in there and just have a complete burnout. And I, you know, I don't even know I'm walking home, and I'm, I'm, the next day I can't even move, and it feels terrible, but I felt like I did more just now in the 10 minutes that we actually worked out than burning it out, burning out by myself. Because I just don't know the technique and that's why I think these videos are so powerful because they're teaching you the technique. And that's what you need. You apply the weight, you have the technique, and the things you can do at home and the, the, the outcome is gonna be awesome. I'm excited. It, it, correct me if I'm wrong, but that's, that's how I feel. I'm with you, I'm with you. You know? I'm with you 100%. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you very much, yeah. my man. Absolutely. Brooke, LP. <laughs> Live free, be free.